Hello and welcome in this video for this exercise was given for uh, the entrance at Cambridge. So the exercise is this one. You want to simplify square root of 10 plus square root of 24 plus square root of 40 plus square root of 60. So if you want to give a try, please pause the video. Otherwise, let's see the solution. Under the root, we notice that three terms could be simplified. Let's simplify these three terms. Square root of 24 could be written as square root of 2 times 2 times 2 times 3. This is 2 times square root of 2 times square root of 3. Next term is square root of 40 and you can write as square root of 2 times 2 times 2 times 5 and this is equal to 2 times square root of 2 times square root of 5. And the last term, this is square root of 60. This is equal to square root of 2 times 2 times 3 times 5. So this is 2 square root of 3 times square root of 5. So now you just switch and you plug these values. Well, you can notice in these three last terms, you've got a common factor, 2. So you can factor by 2 and you end up with square root of 10 plus 2 times square root of 2 times square root of 3 plus square root of 2 times square root of 5 plus square root of 3 times square root of 5. Once you've got this quantity, two times three terms, and these three terms are double products. So then there is a remarkable identity. This is nice to know. A plus B plus C squared. This is A squared plus B squared plus C squared plus two times AB plus BC plus AC. So let's see if we can match this. Let's call A equals to square root of 2. B equals to square root of 3. And C equals to square root of 5. So far, I've got AB B, C, A, C. So next step is to wonder, to check, if you prefer, if A squared plus B squared plus C squared equals to 10. So we can check that square root of 2 squared plus square root of 3 squared plus square root of 5 squared equals to 10. So now I can plug everything under this root and thanks to this remarkable identity I could end up with square root of square root of 2 plus square root of 3 plus square root of 5 squared so you end up with square root of 2 plus square root of 3 plus square root of 5. Thanks for watching this video. I hope to see you in a next video.